hello there dear friend welcome to the channel and thank you for watching in this video i'm going to react to chelsea latest transfer link this time is about borussia mocha glambach midfielder jonas hoffman according to build which is a big sport outlet back in germany Thomas Tuchel want the 28 years old at Chelsea Football Club next summer. You're going to ask yourself, who is this guy? Well, I didn't really know him before this video. I just did some quick research and found out that he's 28 years old and he is a, a right winger. He can also play as a left winger. He can also play in the midfield. But... His um, natural position is right winger. So I asked myself, what's going on here? Do we really need another right winger or a midfielder or even a left winger at Chelsea Football Club? I don't think so. 28 years old, when you have somebody like Kalium Hassan-Odoi who can play in all positions, pretty much you have Hakim Ziyech, you have Christian Pulisic and people forget that we bought Timo Werner and Kai Havert because of their versatility. You know what I mean? Right now people pretend that Frank Lampard was misusing Chris, uh, whatever Timo Werner and Kai Havert but they forgot that when we bought them the reason was that they can play in different positions nobody is talking about that anymore because it's frank lampard and we're supposed to hate everything that he he said back then or he did but i remember when we were linked with timo verna and kai Havert. We were very happy we were celebrating because we got like three players in one somebody who can play as a number nine as a number 10 as a second striker as a winger as whatever but right now people are denying that it never happened timo verna supposed to be in the middle play as a lone striker play as a left number 10 play as a second striker play as the right winger i don't know nobody even knows what is timo verna's natural position now that is another topic for another day because you're not gonna convince everybody depending on your agenda you're gonna back whatever you wanna back but that is i'm not gonna get to that stupidity you know what i mean all i know is timo verna played as a winger as a second striker as a lone striker as in the midfield also but that is the reason why we bought him to begin with same with uh, kai Havert, but it doesn't count now because it was Frank Lampard. If uh, the new guy, Thomas Tuchel, used them in those positions, nobody is going to complain. Since Thomas Tuchel came, Timo Werner is not playing in the, mid in the middle. He is playing as a winger or whatever, you know, number 10. or I don't even know the position, but you know what I'm trying to say. And why people are not complaining? Because it's Thomas Tuchel. So, if we're going to go for this guy here, okay, Hoffman, I don't know, do we really need him? Look at our academy. We can bring few people from the academy. The list is long. Jude can play as a winger. You can go, um, I can go, the list is so long. I'm not going to make this video too long. But I want to show you that in the loan army, army, in the academy, and even in the current team, we have so many players that can play in that position and we don't have to spend like 15 million or 20 million to buy this guy from nowhere because apparently he worked with uh, Thomas Tuchel when he used to be uh, a manager at Dortmund. So we're going to be linked right now with everybody that worked in the past with Thomas Tuchel. Personally, I don't believe in the news i think this is just paper talk because it's gonna make sense okay 
a german coach come to chelsea he need to sign he needs to sign all the germans right sule rudiger you know timo verna kai harvard tomorrow it's gonna be uh, <clears throat> somebody else you know from germany or at least somebody who played in germany it's gonna make sense but it's not gonna happen i don't see it happening but if it's happened i'm not gonna be surprised because it's a chelsea thing and this is how we end up by a lot of dead wood in the team a new manager comes he asked for his own players instead of working with the players that he got already in his disposal and you're gonna end up by people like you know Jorginho and uh, you know Zappa Costa people like that just because the manager wanted to work with uh, a specific kind of players so I thought Chelsea were getting away from that kind of model but since they sacked Frank Lampard they don't want the the, the long term anymore I'm not gonna be surprised that they give uh, Thomas Tuchel the players that he want so he can win so he can win uh, quick trophies it is what it is it's not my money this is not the way i will manage my club i will count more on the academy give the chance to the players who are not even playing there are so many players there sitting on the bench christian pulisic sitting on the bench hakim ziet sitting on the bench and you are going to buy a 28 years old from Germany that we don't really know? I don't think so. I think it's paper talk. But if it's happened, it's happened. It's not my money. It's my club in heart. But on paper, it's Abramovich money and club. So I'm going to have just to accept whatever he's going to impose us. But I'm not happy, man. Leave your comment. Let me know if you knew this guy before watching this video or before today's news do you think he's any good do you think he's going to improve chelsea football club and take a, take us to the next level do you think chelsea need another average winger or midfielder in the team right now how about the players that we already have and we don't give them a chance how about the loan army how about the academy and what would be your reaction if Thomas Tuchel keep on buying German players? Because remember, Frank Lampard was the devil because he wanted to give a chance to apparently only English players. Remember? So what would be your reaction now? Double standard? Are you going to call Thomas Tuchel all kind of names the way you were calling Frank Lampard? You called Frank Lampard racist, all kind of names. He want only to use academy product and English players. He's working for the England national team and blah, blah, blah. Are you going to say the same for Thomas Tuchel? Or we're going to have to understand because it's Thomas Tuchel and he's always right.